Hey guys, in this video I'm going to go over how to fix lag in Euro Truck Simulator 2. But first things first, you want to go ahead and check your PC's system settings, okay? If it does not even meet the minimum requirements, then of course your PC will tend to lag and you'll have to really minimize your settings. Okay, these are the minimum settings. You need an Intel i5, 8 GB RAM. Let me show you how to check this, okay? right click on your start button then go ahead and click on system okay and now right here you should see if i scroll down these are my system settings as you can see i have a 16 gig ram i5 processor i don't quite have a graphics card as you can see but they do recommend a video card and at least a dedicated video ram of about 2048 and be about 2 gb and let me show you how to go ahead and increase your VRAM. It's really easy. What you need to do is this. So, right click on your start button and click on run. Then you just want to type this in, okay? SYSDM.CPL. Press OK. And this will open up your settings where you can go ahead and change your virtual RAM. So, the more virtual RAM you have, the increased performance okay because these processes can run in the background so come here click on advanced and here under performance click on settings and then click on advanced again now click on change right here you want to make sure your ram is a minimum of 1.5 times your you know pc's ram so if your pc comes in with 4 gb ram you want to have a minimum right here of about six thousand six hundred ish okay and then maximum size you want to have about three times your ram so for a 4 gb ram pc you can put it up to 12 gb ram right here and that will take from your storage space and what you can also do is you can right click on your start button again click on task manager and what you want to basically do now is make sure you close all of the unnecessary apps that you're not using that is consuming a lot of your CPU, okay? Go ahead and close those. For example, just click on this one. Just click on end task. Anything that is consuming a lot of your RAM, a lot of your CPU, go ahead and close those. What you can also do is you can upgrade your uh, graphics drivers. So you go ahead and update them like this, right? Click on the start menu, and then you basically want to go ahead and click on a device manager, right? Now let's this open up. I'm going to show you exactly what you need to do. So we're going to be updating our display, you know, graphic drivers from the display adapters category. So right here, I have display adapters. I'm going to click on this arrow. And here I see my graphics card. Right click, click on a, an update driver. Click on search automatically for updated driver software. And if there is anything for updating, go ahead and install that into your PC. And last but not least, what you can do, of course, is right click on your Steam okay and always run your game as an administrator and that should fix your issue and it's really that easy and simple so i hope this guy provided value to you and if it did consider smashing that like button as well as subscribing to find a solution and i'll see you guys in the next one